Maybe this is a part of this is the part of the solution that was not existed here. So before, so an object is placed two centimeters. This is an object is placed two centimeters from in front of a diverging lens, which has a power of minus twenty five diopters. The image located is located at. That is a question. So you have the virgin lens, you have an object, you have an image. We don't, we didn't know this. We, we drive this. So how could I find the image? Where is the image if I have a object in front of the divergent lens? How to do that? So let's see how to do that. So we have the optic, optical axis. And in the middle we have some diverging lens. Okay, this will be the lens. And we have object here. Now, where is the image? Okay. The foc focal point. Where is the focal point? Where is the focal point of these objects? <laughs> we'll do that uh, later. Okay, we draw one parallel line to the optical axis, so this is parallel to this, and because this is diverging lens, what do we know? We know that will not that these rays will not converge in some point, and that point will be a focal point. That rays will con will diverge from this. Okay, it will diverge somewhere. Let's say somewhere up has to go upwards. So, wh how, where is the focal point? Well, focal point is here. This is a focal point. And distance from here to here is the focal length. Okay. Now for the second ray. If it goes straight to the through the center of the lens, to just go like nothing is there. So, where is the image? Image is here. That's all there is to it. Now you describe the image. What is what kind of image is this? Well, that is a virtual image. Why is that? Because there is one virtual line. This is not real line. So let us return to the assignment. Okay, this is slightly better image. This is the image, this is the object, and this is the focal this is the distance to the image, this is the distance to the object, and this is the distance to the focal point. Okay, that focal point could be here and there, but after some calculation you could draw a pre precise picture. So what is this power of the lens in the opter? And that stands with a focal length in P is equal one to the focal length. The focal length is one to the P, and that is one divided by minus twenty four, and that is minus zero point zero four meters. Why is that minus? Because that is, as you can see, is not real. Uh, it's not in cross section of the real rays, but in uh, those. How do you call this ray? Imaginary. Okay, this is the uh, lens equation. One divided by the distance to the Object plus one divided by distance to the image is equal to one divided by the the focal length. And when you place everything here, distance to the image is this much, and distance to the image is that much. And this is the distance to the image. It's minus one point three 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 centimeters. Minus that is not because that it is upright, but it is not real image. It is virtual and from here, what is this? That is minus 1.33 centimeters, and object is 2 centimeters. So this is in front of the object. So this picture is better than the, this one that I used to explain the situation, but this also could be correct, doesn't matter. So I told you everything. There's nothing more here except to describe this image. So object is upright. <laughs> Object is not object, it is image. 
image is upright, virtual, and located on the same side of the lens as the object, between the lens and the object. So, that is a description of the image. That's all there is to it. So, there is nothing more. But if you want to download this solution, nonetheless, you could do that. For complete little answer, please follow the link in the description. If you want more of this, please subscribe and tell your friends. Thank you. Bye.